Hey there, this is Pastor Rich, and I wanted to just give a brief sermon summary for to, from today's sermon. We looked at the Proverbs and what the Proverbs says about our path. It has a lot of things to say about our path, and when it talks about our path, it's really talking about the road in life that we travel down. And you know, the Bible tells us a lot of things that God will do and God's wisdom will do for us. We looked at how it says that that it will direct our path when we follow the wisdom of God. And you know, the things that we do in life, the choices that we make, small or big, good or bad, they really determine where we end up in life. And you know, that's important is what we do with this life. And really, we want this life to count. We want this life to matter. We want this life to make a difference for other people and in the kingdom of God. And you know, it's important for us to allow God and His wisdom to direct our path. We see that the Proverbs, it says that it will also protect our path. You know, once we're on that right path, there's things that will try to pull us off the path. The world, the influence of the world, the influence of our flesh, and then there's the enemy that will try to drag us down to get us onto another path. One that maybe leads to destruction. One that maybe leads to a place we don't want to end up. We also see that wisdom, what it will do is it will make our path straight or help us to get through those obstacles that will come up. We looked at what we need to do so that we can gain this wisdom. And Proverbs chapter 2, uh, verses 1 and 2, it says that first we need to seek to understand this wisdom. Verse 3, it says that we should cry out, that we should pray. Then when we listen and try to gain understanding, what we need to do is we really need to dig for that wisdom, just as if it's a, like buried treasure that we see from Proverbs uh, 2 verse 4. We see that we need to go and try to seek out that wisdom just like it is that buried treasure. And you know, really, in a sense, it's, it's even better than buried treasure. It will guide our life. It will protect our life. It will help us to end up where God would have us in life. But you know, it's up to us to take the time to find that wisdom. And as we see from Proverbs 4.10, the most important thing is once we get it to apply it into our lives. You know, God, He can direct our path. His wisdom will help us and help the course of our life. And so it's important for us to make sure that we're on that right path. This week in our home groups, what we're going to do is we're going to look at this in a little more detail and the things that we need to do that will help us to make sure that we are on that right path. I'd hope that you come and join us and we'd love to have you join us uh, for this. And, you know, it's really important what kind of path we're on because that's going to determine the course of our life and how this life uh, the things that we, we do and the things that we achieve in this life. And so anyway, I hope you guys have a great week and I hope to see you in the home group this week. God bless you guys.